Hey guys, so this video is a little later than I originally intended, but I kind of think that it was worth it. I thought long and hard on this cast list, and in all honesty, it was a really difficult decision, and I really wish that I could have casted everyone who auditioned. So I did! This is an AU that's going to require a lot of voice actors for side roles, and because that's the case, everybody who sent in an audition will be eligible to be a voice in this AU in some way or another. I just wanted to let everyone know that before getting into the main cast of episode 1, since I don't want anyone to feel disappointed. You all did so amazing, and I feel so lucky to have gotten to listen to all you talented people. Now that that's said, onto the cast list of episode 1. It's going to be in the order that was given in the audition form, so it'll look something like this. I'd also like to point out that the cast was picked based on how well they performed for the character, and how well they sounded with the rest of the cast. No other factors were considered while I was casting. Another thing is that I will be referring to the cast members by either the name they had given me, or their social media usernames. Anyway, let's start with Patton. Patton was definitely a difficult decision, as was everyone really, but in the end I decided to cast Allison for the role. She had a voice that I thought was really good for him, managing to be a good balance between sweet and also slightly intimidating, but in a very Patton way. Next up is Janice. Surprisingly, Janice had one of the highest numbers of auditions, and while I thought everyone did a great job on him, I decided that Janice would be played by Nico. Their voice seemed to really match Janice and seemed to be just what I was looking for when it came to him. Next up is Roman. Roman was the other person who had one of the highest numbers of auditions, but in the end, I decided that Atticus will be playing him. It almost felt as if he was made for the role of Roman, being perfectly dramatic in the best ways. Next up is Remus. Remus, I felt, was a difficult character to perform because I was trying to find a good balance between Remus while also being, you know, a kid. But I felt as though Leaf was able to get that balance perfectly. I was honestly really surprised by the voice that he gave Remus, and it just sounded perfect. Next up is Logan. While Logan didn't have the highest number of auditions, he definitely had a lot which resulted in him being the second most auditioned for a character. He was another really difficult person to cast, of course, but in the end, I went with Connor. They overall did an amazing job with Logan and managed to find a good balance with his character traits, which included him being a bit of a know-it-all, while also maintaining his childlike tone. Next, we have Virgil. Once again, another difficult character to cast, but I decided to go with Kayla, as she was able to get the type of tone that I was looking for when it came to him. Next up, we have Harold, aka the Commodore, and Elizabeth. The Commodore will be played by Hello Random Person, aka Barbie, and Elizabeth will be played by One Anxious Mess. I felt as though they were able to fit the voices of the parents really well with their auditions, and I thought that they worked really well together. While the main characters have been casted, there will also be four side characters within episode one. And these four characters will be played by Whisk, Aradella, Kim, and Dark Strange Dad. Congratulations to everyone in the cast of episode 1 of the Guilty Party AU. I can't wait to work with all of you, and I can't wait to work with everyone who auditioned in the future. Everyone did such an amazing job, and this project wouldn't be possible without any of you. I hope that you all have an amazing rest of your day, and I hope that you enjoy what this AU turns out to be. Bye!